Hello, everybody. Let's continue trying to fight Lorena. Relana, I mean. That's how unimportant you are, bitch. Don't even remember your name. Let's go. I said, let's go. And you never knew it, and you never knew. I feel like the closer you are to her, the more crazy shit she does. You have to play a distance game. I think I'm gonna put the turtle charm on for extra stamina. I really feel like that's gonna help. Okay. No second phase yet, weird. Wow. Two, three, four. So usually when you're close up to her, she'll do the fire. This time she was like, nope. Uh, I didn't even get to see like if that would work or not. Um, what's that do? Stamina recovery speed, yes, please. I think I really need that for this fight. She's just so intense and like fast paced. Automatic magic's off rip. That shit is helping a lot right now. Wow.
doing some shit right now. I can definitely do it. Try some. Switch this out for the fire negation. Blood Fang always coming through, bro, no matter what. Crazy.
Oh. My God! Fuck you, bitch! No! 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 You fucking guy! I fucking hate you! Oh my God! Oh my God! Hardest boss in this fucking game so far, bro. Oh my God! I did not expect that to be the one right there, bro. Did not expect that to be the fucking one. A smarter man would have went around and got the fucking skitter trees. I was stubborn. And it took me a while to kill her. I think it took me two hours to kill her, or something like that. Jesus Christ, and I did it with Bloodfang again. Bloodfang to the rescue again. I did not expect that. I was like, yo, if I could stun her, I can do this. I got that fucking stun. I was getting a little bit more aggressive to get that stun, because her fire damage was going to kill me if I kept blocking. I had to do something. Wow, wow, wow. It's been God of Darren, the one of man taking out Relana. That fucking name, I don't even remember. <laughs> Without any fucking help. Solo Dola. I didn't think shit could get much harder than Millennia or that dancing lion, but boy, was I wrong. Wow. And if this is any inclination of this DLC, I better go and get those skittle trees. Seeds, I gotta go get them. This is fucking ridiculous. I think four or five should be enough for, for now. I got three. Yeah, I should have had four. I feel like, I think I have too little. Anyway, I didn't really, um, explore the entirety of this castle I'm gonna do so now I also equipped my axe and my swords feel the fucking ferocious pains ow no never Fast for you, fool. I, uh... Just trying to see if I miss anything here. All I want to do. Is 
see here, I want to use this. Come on up. They ain't dropped the Smith and Stone 5. down here did I no never got this item dude gem ow who the hell hit me trying to snipe me from a distance Since I'm back to fighting these guys, let me switch back to what I had before. So as to get the, uh, if I can find it. So it's to get the maximum damages. Cool. Oh, never was up here. Likely plump sword. There's an item down there. That just brings me down there. Wowzers, make schmowzers. I think I will go down here then. Glint Blade Trio. Looks like I can use it. Faith 28. I mean, uh, intelligence. Create sigil that forms three projectile glint blades after delay. An old sorcery of the Carrion Royal family creates a signal overhead from which three enemy seeking glint blades appear after a brief delay. The sorcery can be used while in motion. Charging increases the delay. The prototypical form of sword phalanx sorcery saw a different subsequent refinement in the realm of shadow. Definitely gonna equip that. Seems useful. I ain't never get this chest here. A wolf crest shield. Didn't I have like a hawk crest shield or something? Serpent. Provides better lightning and holy, but the serpent's better for fire. But it's better for magic. Finally made blue shield featuring an engraving of a wolf under the moon. Excels at fending off sorceries. The wolf is the beast of the Carrion Royal Covenant. A symbol of the moon's pride that none can forget. No matter what remote lands they may arrive in. Has no skill.
can't parry with it. It's interesting. Yeah, I remember being over here. back over here. Anything under here? No. Counter back there. Is there anything out here? Oh shit, it looks like I could make that jump. Nothing here. Oh, shit. Forgot to zoom in with this thing. I'm gonna kill myself trying to use this fucking thing. All right, here we go. Up and down on the D pad. Definitely never been over there. part of the map is that a part I've never been to there's a tower here hmm I don't think I've ever been in this tower yeah I've never been here Before I go up, look around. Hold up, am I able to go down from here too? Nah, right? Maybe from where I killed Rolana is where I could go over there. Maybe, perhaps. There's nothing down there. A ladder and a walkway. Come over here first. Where are you leading me, game? That's death. Why am I here? The fuck is the purpose of that bridge? Makes no sense. the sense of it. You're damn right, ain't shit up out of this. It's stupid. I 
treasure. Wing stance, ash of war. What the hell? Sash of War grants armament equality, affinity, and following skill. Wing stance. Calmly assume a right-sided stance. Normal attack triggers rapid three-slash combination. Strong attack triggers a leaping thrust. Usable on light great swords. Is that for the Milady sword that I got yesterday, maybe? Or is that just the Milady sword, Sash of War, and I just found it? I can drop down here. He's lost. He's like, what is this for? Yeah, I'm right there with you, buddy. Ah, uh, prawn. Yeah, lobster down there. Nah, there's got to be a reason for being over there, man. Even if there's not, a, not an item, there's got to be a reason. But I don't think I could drop down from here. Okay, I could. And I did. Armor ahead. Where? Down here. Does he mean the. Oh, him? I killed him already. Alright. I'm satisfied. What I want to do now is I want to check out this area. I never went over there. Well, let's go to the beginning. Uh, actually, kind of want to see what I can do with that giant. The flames. I don't want to. I feel like I'm gonna get destroyed instantly here, but let's try. We've got to try. I'm here for you, scum. Let's go. Ow. Hurt you. Oh God. No, don't dip me in there. Ugh, get me, kill me. Well, that went about as good as I thought it would. He dumped me in his fucking head. He roasted me like yesterday's barbecue. I'll have my fucking revenge. You better believe, oh, you better believe. As soon as I get my runes. Don't tell me my runes are in his head still. Excuse me, sir. Wow. The flames of fucking putridness. Oh my god. Nah, he's a boss in himself, bro. He's a boss onto himself. Am I even hurting this fucking thing? I'm doing nothing. I'm leaving. Fuck you. I'll come after you after I've killed the last boss in this fucking DLC. How's that one? Stop chasing me. Don't you ever chase me. Don't try to stop me, Smee. Don't you ever try to stop me. I'm gonna fight people my own size. You're a bully. And a menace. Let me go check over here real quick. Hmm. The hell are you? Uh, you. Motherfucker. Well then come on. Oh, 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 the nasty moves. Is 
is gonna kill me? You little bitch. There's a waterfall of black waters. I gotta get up there somehow. What's this? Another one of these. Revered Spirit Ash. The game's really. I like that's the way of the game telling you use your spirit ashes. I really feel like that is. Don't be a tryhard. But there's some of us that grew up with the old. Dark Souls games and never had Spirit Ashes and when we had summons we didn't use them. Felt like that was cheating the game to use a summons to to have a fucking partner come in. The only time I felt like it wasn't a cheese was when there was more than one boss to fight. Then I felt like it was it was valid. Even then I didn't do it just out of being pit pig headed. But I just wanted the bragging rights of saying I did it by myself. But what the fuck? The optimal thing would be to take advantage of what the game's given you. Just me personally, I'm just so used to not using it on the older games, so that's why I'm trying not to use it. If I can help it. But I don't look down on anyone who decides to do it. Much. <laughs> No, I think uh, you're cheating yourself out of a good experience, though. If you use Spirit Ash to, like... What is it? What's the word I'm looking for, man? To distract the boss, you know? There's just something... So, something more... To the experience of fighting a boss one on one makes it more special and epic to me personally. But whatever, whatever you enjoy doing in these games, just do it. Bosses are still hard, even with the fucking spirit ashes, I imagine. I used um, Summons and Spirit Ash the first time I fought Godric, and it was still a pain in the ass. So it's not like it really fucking makes it moot or anything. It just makes it a little easier. Not everybody has hours to dedicate to fighting a one guy. You know? And some people just want to get to the to the meat and potatoes of the game. Hard to do it when you're s fucking soft locked on a boss. Another one of you, eh? Very well. Ow. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Still black gray ammo. Up, you faker fucker. Skid a tree fragment, nice. That's the fuck I need. 
I should have came over here before. That fight would have been easier. See? Fuck that shit. I'm looking for skidoo tree fragments everywhere I can now. If I ever see a boss fog wall again, I'm fucking leaving. Like, nope. Skidoo tree fragment for me, please. Blessing America. Look at this shit. If these things prove to be stronger, Mesmer's soldier axe. I'm just finding a bunch of shit. What is this shit? Completely restore HP and heal all ailments. Is this a... Yeah, it's a one-time use, I believe. Uh, and what of this axe that I found? The Mesmer axe. The Mesmerizings. Oh, and this too. 140 base damage. Weapon of the Black Knight servants, Mesmer and the Impaler. Great hammer, black steel with decorative embellishments in gold. Blessed with an Eritrea incantation, further holy imbuement will amplify the effect. Greatly increase the armament's power. Guard counters cause a burst of power. Guard counters. Ooh. Endures the skill. Assume an anchored stance to brace for incoming attacks. Briefly boosting poise. Damage taken while using the skill is reduced. Ooh, that sounds nice. Giant crusher. All right, where's that axe at? I've not seen it. Should be up here. These are where my axes are. Therefore, it should be a bean. Steel axe for worn from use. Favorite of those who lost themselves utterly in their Lord's War. Capable of performing powerful charge attacks. War cry is a skill. We've had War cry before, I think. Nothing that special. Look at that. Seek armor all the more time for beating to a pulp. Whatever you say, buddy. Whatever you are then. Fuck am I on this map? I would like to uncover more map. Church of Constellation. Ooh. And jig the flame hound, he said. Cause he will jig. Oh, he'll jig. Whole fucking platoon. Then let's go. Never in your life, kid. Smith and Stone Galore. Nothing in the tent, you cheap bastards. Here we go. A fire coil. What the hell is this now? Uses FP to conjure a tiny fire snake. What the fuck? A craftable item. Fire was a symbol of the crusade, and even Mesmer's rank and file, file soldiers would wield it. So it sounds like Mesmer is a fire user. Sounds like I might want some kind of wind technique. No, wind makes fire stronger. I might want, I don't know, ice maybe. To put out that fire. I don't know if they have water. I don't think they do, so... If I ever get to Mesmer, I'll be using ice. Thought there'd be more to this area, to be honest. I thought I'd find a fucking map or something. Nothing here. 
There's two maps up here, though. Alright, how do I... Which I go here? The bottom of that water. There's a cross over there. Oh, it's just a... Just an incantation. But yeah, I can't be making the game harder for myself. I made it harder for myself fighting that bitch. I had nightmares, I tell you, nightmares. Refuse to have them again. Wake up, wake up, wake up. It's the first of the bump. Keep going north, he says. That'll bring you to where you need be. Past the gravestones and the rocks. Wonder if I can get up here with them. Let's see. Hold up. What the fuck? Something stopped me from jumping. Oh shit! Hold up now. about this I don't know nah gotta do it from above I think all of you shall feel the terror Break my fucking horse, you piece of shit. Get the fuck. Fuck you. Been in here? What the hell? What the fuck is this? Sacred Tower painting. Work of a wandering artist reminisce of a painting titled The Sacred Tower. This painter is said to have captured the landscapes seen during the last moments of those welcomed into death's embrace. The soul of the painter and vestiges of the dead's last moments can be discovered by visiting a location depicted even now. I haven't seen anything like that, I don't think. Unless that's it up ahead there. Oh, fire giant, I will murk you when I get a chance. You better fucking believe. I'll never forgive you for what you've done. Nobody murks me and lives. Why are there so many of you I demand to know? Nothing here. Wait, a what? I passed it. Run through it so as to get rid of it. Well, fucking then. Nah, man. There's gotta be a way down. Holy shit. There's a bridge though, and I should be able to cross that bridge and get over there. Go 
off to the left here. Oh shit, the birds. I'm gonna stop this here because I'm doing a recording format and then uh, I'm gonna start a stream right after this. Yeah, let me see if I could add that skitter tree seed though. Wow, all I needed to do was that and I would have been up to four. Fuck you, game. Oh my god, I'm out of here. I'll fucking see you in the stream. Jesus Christ. <laughs> 